Here's the real reason why you shouldn't use temp and tint to white balance your footage. Let's add a note. Now I'm going to white balance the shot using temp and tint. And I'm going to be paying very close attention to my vector scope while I do it. Alright, it's a little cool. Let's bring in some warmth. We're going to add some magenta. Okay, everything looks pretty good. Alright, same clip. Let's just use the offset here. And go up. Okay, so that looks good to me. Everything looks balanced in the vector scope. They look pretty different. But let's pay attention to the vector scope of each. So here we have our temp versus tint, and then here we have our offset. And as you can see, they look slightly different. And the reason why, when we're using temp and tint, we're sliding from blue to orange and green to magenta. And these are just four different colors. And they're primarily targeting the midtones, which can leave the shadows and the highlights a little muddy. And when we're adjusting with our offset, we are adjusting our shadows, midtones, and highlights uniformly 